Welcome back to Energy Motor Cars. I had to put this truck in sideways because it's so huge. And today I'm gonna be walking around it, showing you inside and out. And it's gonna be live on the website for sale as soon as this video is up. So this is a 2017 Ram 3500 mega cab, four wheel drive. It has the high output Cummins and it has the Eisen transmission. And uh, I'll, if I remember, hopefully, I will show you the window sticker. We'll talk a little bit about that because I've had another truck with the Eisen transmission. And uh, so we'll just kind of talk about that. The high output Cummins, I believe, is 900 foot-pounds of torque. This truck is an absolute beast. As you can see, it's lifted. It has a 6-inch Pro Comp lift, 22-inch fuel wheels. They're 22 by 11s. And 37, 1350 Toyos. So the lift is Pro Comp. It's got a BDS dual Fox steering stabilizer. So that looks pretty cool going down the road. And then it also has, and it's got amp steps. So those will come out as soon as I open the door, you'll see that. And then it has these recoil traction bars uh, as well. You saw the LED bar in the front. So truck is ready to go. It is a sweet rig. It's an absolute monster. I don't know if you can really get the size of this thing in the video but uh, in person, it's massive. The guy actually traded this truck in on the TRX that I had. So if you guys saw the uh, 2021 Launch Edition TRX on 37s, this is, uh, this is the guy, the new owner of, uh, of that truck. And so now I've got this one that uh, I'm gonna be selling. Oh, it also has this MagnaFlow DPF back exhaust. Now the exhaust has not been modified uh, as far as an emission standpoint. Uh, so it's literally just the DPF back. Um, it starts right there at that clamp and then just uh, it's just the tips. So it's purely cosmetic, uh, no performance gain as far as I know, and then uh, no emissions. No, nothing's, nothing's been deleted or anything like that. Truck's not been tuned uh, mechanically. It's, it's uh, stock like engine transmission, um, gearing, all that stuff is stock, tuned is stock but uh, it's got the suspension, wheels, tires, it's got the cosmetic stuff, so. Oh, it has these Bushwhacker fender flares as well. They're paint matched. Um, this color, this, this metallic black, I forget the actual paint uh, name, probably see it when we get to the window sticker, but um, uh, it's real metallic, looks good in the sun, and, uh, and then the, the flares are, are matched as well. So this truck is a Laramie, and then it has the Sport Appearance package on top of that. So the Sport Appearance, appearance package, it blacks everything out. So you get all the color match stuff, the painted grill, the painted bumpers. Um, I think the mirrors are always black on these. And then the emblems are normally black, but the previous owner, he removed them. So the truck is real clean. Um, so yeah, uh, then the black headlights, black taillights. So uh, I'm sure you saw it, but we'll just walk back around to those taillights so you can see that. So the taillights are like a smoked LED, uh, which is really cool. And then, um, this truck has a lot of really nice options. Uh, of course, it's four-wheel drive, and like I said, it is just a monster. So, um, 371350, see the tire size there, 371350, 22, 22 by 11 fuels, wheels are in perfect shape, no curb rash or anything. It's actually pretty hard to curb a wheel uh, on such a chunky tire, but um, tires are in real good shape. See the Pro Comp shocks back there. The back is a lift block, and uh, of course the longer shocks. And then the front is a bigger, uh, longer coil spring. The shocks. Uh, it's got like a bunch of drop brackets for the sway bar and stuff like that. And then it's got these Pro Comp. Uh, I forget what the name of these things are, but anyway, these bars um, it replaces the, the factory ones. Um, so you don't just have a drop bracket. You actually have a replacement uh, bar there. So. Open the door, you see the steps come out, and then it's got the, whoops, didn't open the door enough, but now you can see them retract. It's got the LEDs as well, and then it's plugged into the uh, OBD, so it's a plug and play uh, system for the steps. And then this truck has uh, the factory auxiliary switches, and that, that auxiliary number one is actually what runs the, uh, the light bar, so it's wired up to that auxiliary switch. And this light bar, um, it's curved perfectly for the bumper. I mean, it fits so well in there. And uh, if you know these trucks really well, you'll know that by putting that light bar in the front, it actually uh, replaces where the tow hooks go. I have the tow hooks to the truck. So uh, if you wanted to take the light bar out and put the tow hooks back in, I have them, they're available. 
So they'll come with it, of course. Uh, black interior, leather, heated, cooled seats, no sunroof on this one. I think that's probably the only option that this truck didn't have. Um, power pedals, of course you got all your steering wheel controls. I'll jump in it in a minute, but like, it's tall. <laughs> Uh, power folding mirrors, which is nice, and the tow mirrors as well. These tow mirrors flip up. Uh, if you're familiar with these, then you know that. I got my hand sanitizer in there because I was driving the truck. Carpet mats, uh, and very, very clean. If I didn't mention it already, this is a 2017. This truck has 13,000 miles on it. It's got both keys. It has the keyless go. Uh, so I'll go ahead and jump in so we can talk a little bit more about this stuff. So it's got the keyless go. Here's your push button start. Uh, it has the 8.4 inch Uconnect. There's all your controls, trailer brake controller, of course your four wheel drive, and then your auxiliary switches down there at the bottom. So that's nice. Uh, exhaust brake, traction, traction control, Alpine sound system. It's got your um, home link. Uh, I think GM calls it home link. I don't know what Dodge or Ram calls it, but power rear. Uh, sliding window as well. Has your two um, storage uh, glove boxes. So one down there, one there. Now in this Ziploc bag, uh, it's like a bunch of factory uh, connections. Like this is stuff that the truck came with new. And then it has every single manual and window sticker uh, that the truck came with. So I will probably, uh, hopefully remember to open that up here in a second and show you guys. Um, I like that, that Ram does this right here. Um, this is a, your spot for your cell phone. So it, uh, it kind of uh, form fits in there and stays in place really nice. Tons of storage. So um, I have, uh, like I said, I've been driving it. So I got my, my stuff plugged in there. Two different consoles. It even comes with a little touch up pin for the paint. So uh, tons and tons of storage. And then all the magic happens in the back of these trucks it is a mega cab so you know the mega cabs the rear seats recline right there and then they also fold down flat so I'm gonna pull that and just show you uh, how much room you have so behind the seats and I apologize I know it's gonna be real hard to see with my uh, phone camera but tons and tons of storage behind the seats and then of course like I said they fold flat as well and then you even have storage in here so this lifts up and you've got storage I mean storage for days storage upon storage upon storage and still fit five people comfortably in there I like five adults comfortably you know not just like five little people I'm talking about five comfortable adults heated rear seats got rear air conditioning vents I believe those are speakers yeah speakers for the Alpine sound system it's got a subwoofer in it uh, factory subwoofer sounds very good I uh, was quite impressed I had a 2016 a long time ago and then uh, this one's a 2017 so pretty much the same truck I forgot how good the sound system was in these trucks uh, six and a half foot bed on the mega cabs and it has a spray and bed liner so and then you get your LED lights as well backup camera of course parking sensors uh, it even has this 14 inch custom drop hitch and then I'll just show you kind of underneath truck is exceptionally clean it really is clean came from California so don't have to worry about rust or anything like that um, and yeah no dents no scratches there's some rock chips on the front bumper just from you know driving it here and there uh, but really clean truck I think you would genuinely be hard-pressed to find another 2017 that's this clean See underneath it there. I already kind of showed that a little bit, but see the stabilizer, some of the drop brackets for the lift. Um, but yeah, uh, I don't think this truck's ever been off road. Certainly no indication that it's ever been off road. You can just see how clean everything is, even like inner fender. And I, I, I got it like this. I mean, all I did was have the truck washed. That's it. Um, so it is very, very clean. I'll show you kind of this side as well traction bars and then just underneath the truck ultra clean truck um, okay now very very clean on this side as well I mean, you can see like the black carpet it looks uh, it looks new 
So I'm gonna pull this um, manual out and set it on the tailgate and then just kind of talk about some of the stuff. So in here are all of your original books and manuals. That's the window sticker, I'll go over that in just a second. Now I'm not gonna pull all these out, but it's got everything, right? It has the original, uh, sorry, it's out of focus, but uh, it's got like all the original books. Um, it's even got like some California mission stuff in there. And so here is the original window sticker. I mentioned this truck is a 3500, it's not a 2500, so there you go. Mega cab, uh, brilliant black, that's what the, color is called brilliant black it's got um, Laramie package 28h whatever the heck that is and then convenience group sport appearance group I talked about that um, with uh, all the color match stuff Eisen six-speed transmission um, that's huge with guys that are gonna tow it's it's uh, quite a bit better than the 68 RFE um, you know it talks about the Cummins spray and bed liner remote start power pedals all that stuff so there you go you see the original window sticker for all the options. And now I will, uh, I'll go ahead and fire the truck up and uh, let it run for a minute. Drove it around a little bit today and it rides really well. I had a lifted uh, 2016, I mentioned it, that uh, rode a little bit stiff. I had a zone lift on my 16. This truck has the Pro Comp lift and I can tell you it rides significantly better than my zone lift. Um, Zone's made by BDS, so I thought it would be good, but it rode really stiff. I mean, it was uncomfortable it rode so stiff. Uh, but you can see the mileage there. Oh, it just went away. It was 13,088. So, there you go. 13,088 miles. Got the heated and cold seats, heated steering wheel, uh, navigation, Bluetooth, XM radio. All that stuff. I am gonna turn down the AC because that's probably gonna be annoying in the video. But yeah, I mean, you can just see everything. Um, runs great. Full tank of DEF, and the truck will be completely serviced. I'm actually taking it over to the Dodge dealer uh, in another day to uh, do the oil, uh, fuel filters, and uh, just do like a 15,000 mile service on it. So there it is, guys. But yeah, there it is. You got all your all your mega cab room. Uh, I'll just jump out so you can hear the truck running a little bit. Like I said, um, no performance modifications, so the motor's stock. Tell you what, I will go ahead and turn on the light bar. So uh, I'll just hit aux one and I can already see my shop light up like crazy. So there is the light bar on. And uh, yeah, turn the truck off. So yeah, it's just that, that switch there. But yeah, there you have it, 2017. Ram 3500 Mega Cab, high output Cummins, Eisen transmission, six inch lift, 37s, 22s. She's ready to go. Um, if you're interested in this truck, my phone number here is 281-768-5290. Website is energymotorcars.com. Facebook and Instagram are both at energymotorcars. Thanks for watching, guys. Really excited for somebody to get this truck and uh, hope to hear from you soon.